10 media executives under the cloak of anonymity predict 2022's industry-shaking events. And I'm sure all of these will completely be right and no one will be wrong, right? Uh, number one says Roku buys Liongate Studio. Um, number two is Bob Iger returns to Disney as CEO. That sounds interesting. Um, Chopic is the Disney CEO now, has been there for two years. Iger repeatedly extended his contract after planning to retire in 2015, 16, and 18 before abruptly stand, stepping down in 2020. Uh, the third and fourth prediction, which is apparently two votes by anonymous executives, will be Viacom CBS will merge or sell. Uh, Viacom, maybe you going you going towards uh, uh, NBC CBS. Number five, the free radicals will sell. I have no idea what that is. Billionaire model, media mogul John Malone coined the term free radicals to define pure play content. Companies that don't have the scale to compete for top-notch movies and TV shows against behemoths. Um, so they're saying free radicals have already been consolidated like Viacom, Viacom, CBS, Warner and Discovery, uh, Amazon, MGM. So these are apparently not not tiny companies, but smaller companies that can't compete with the huge companies getting bought, dude. Vice will sell itself in pieces, says executive number six. That's interesting. Vox Media will go public, says executive number seven. A lot of media going on. Uh, a major sports betting company will go bay bankrupt or sell for peanuts, uh, says executive number eight. Apple will buy a movie slash TV studio. This one is probably not the riskiest of bets ever. <laughs> um, shout out Ted Lasso. And executive number 10 says free advertising supported streaming services will consolidate. Um, Fox is Tubi. Smart TV, this executive predicted free streaming TV will have surging growth in 2022, but will also consolidate. 